Good morning, you guys. So I'm in my car, as you can see, I have my iced coffee bright and early. I'm at, or sitting outside, of course, I'm parked next to two cars and that's okay. I always seem to park when someone else is sitting in their car. Um, enjoying my iced coffee this morning. It's actually quite early. I got out at, or it's 10, and thought I would do like a little mukbang in the car with you since I had so many requests in my last vlog to do a mukbang. Uh, so I just got a breakfast sandwich and a salad, so I'm really excited. And also, um, I have some exciting news. There's like a bunch of things I actually want to talk about with you. So I just thought this would be really fun. And then I'm driving to home sense because I'm hosting a little, uh, get together, not very many people, but a little get together for my launch party of my makeup line. And I'm going to be, um, doing kind of like a pink and beige boho theme. And if you guys know me, I am not boho at all. So I basically have to buy every Thing brand new and see what I can find. I wanted to quickly show you guys this amazing meal not the cleanest thing to eat in my car but that's okay but wow it's very like spring vibes wow we have some fun vibrant colors here in the back i had to move my car but now i'm still stuck between two people i guess it's just a day that everyone wants to sit in their car and just I don't know. I don't know what's happening, but uh, today's video is sponsored by Audible, which I'm so excited about, and what better time than sharing with you guys like what I do to listen to audiobooks and how I've kind of, I guess, worked it into my schedule and how I've been enjoying it a whole lot uh, for my like relaxation and my self-care routine. Uh, so if you guys haven't heard of Audible, basically they have the largest selection of audiobooks. There are so many different genres you can choose from. And for myself personally, you already know, like I love beauty, uh, audiobooks, and then also entrepreneur business related audiobooks. So there's this girl I've been so obsessed with also on Instagram, uh, but Rachel Hollis, and she has a book, um, audiobook that I've been listening to. Words they use to describe their own hardships and it makes my heart hurt so I write them back I tell every single one how beautiful and strong she is I call them warrior and I just had it playing in my car actually and she's just such and like she's just she says it how it is and that's what I really respect about her because I know I've told you guys so many times there's nothing more um, beautiful than being your true authentic self and also if you're a mom and you're balancing business and trying to start your own company and run a company from home and all those things she goes through everything and kind of how you can still enjoy life and 
things, you know, to do for yourself. Um, and I just honestly, like if you take a listen to it and even just, um, re like there's a little thing that you can click to have a preview. It's the best audiobook I've ever listened to. And I just love it. I think I've listened to it three times already. And the other thing I've been doing, I've actually been putting in like my headphones, you know, those big clunky headphones I have, and I'll just do it throughout the day. Like if I'm in the kitchen cooking, uh, you guys know I've been cooking a lot lately. So if I'm cooking, I'll throw the headphones on. If I'm cleaning the house, I'll also listen to an audiobook. And I just think it's such a nice way to kind of like, I find it extremely relaxing and there's something about reading that I do not like and I know I've been very blunt about this but I've never been book smart like when I was in sorry my camera's shaking there we go when I was in school high school like I was never book smart I didn't like to read books I've probably only finished a few books my entire life um and I would always look at pictures so audiobooks are just such a great way for me to learn and I think even to learn like I'm still learning everything that there is about business and I don't know everything and I don't know everything about social media and influencing and all that stuff. So it's really nice that I can listen to other people throughout the day if, it, if I'm driving and kind of fit it into my schedule and my routine because days get busy, man. Like with twins at home, like you already know how crazy it is. So to even have the time to sit in my car and do like a little mukbang with you, um, is enjoyable. So I really enjoy these moments where I can sit down and do that. And also if you go to Audible's Plus category, you can select audiobooks, podcasts, Audible Originals, and fitness, meditation. There's so many things, even sleep tracks, which honestly, <laughs> I it's hilarious because Ryan and I, we have the sleep machine on for me and Sophia, but those nights where they ran into our room, I would just throw it on like to have some white noise, background noise, rainfalls and things. And it helps us sleep. It's so true. But not only for babies, but for us. Like I sleep like a baby when I listen to things like that. Not only will you guys get 30 days free trial, but also you'll be able to go through the entire Audible um, Plus category as well. So that's really, really awesome. And all you guys have to do is go to audible.com slash slmissglam or text SL Miss Glam to 500 500. So I just wanted to say thank you to Audible for sponsoring this video because I was really excited to partner with them. And you guys know I only partner really with companies that I've have in my life that I know of so it was just really really awesome to have this kind of partnership so I'm really fortunate for that and if you guys want to check it out I'll have everything linked down in the description box as well um but yeah I'm gonna get into my breakfast here which looks so so good and then we're gonna head to home sense but I am starving I didn't get to eat this morning because uh okay so big news today's well yeah I'm filming this a bit early but um tomorrow I'm having like a little Mother's Day shoot and also on Thursday but this will be uploaded on Friday uh so this would have already happened but I just found out that I'm gonna be doing um a clubhouse with Ipsy so Ipsy asked me they're like are you free Thursday we'd love to have you talk as a speaker and I said sure like by the way I'm just putting this like dressing on the sauce god this is gonna be messy um, how do people do this? Like I see mukbangs in the car all the time. Like this is not the cleanest thing ever. Oh man. Okay. So anyways, so they were like, are you free? And I'm like thinking, I'm like, oh sure. And then they're like, there's going to be other brand owners, um, in the clubhouse. And I said, okay, that's awesome. So I download it and, uh, yeah. So I downloaded it yesterday and I saw who I'm on the call with and Christine Dominique and then the owner of Jouer Cosmetics so Christina these are two like very inspirational women that I have felt have been above and beyond are above and beyond me and both their brands are in Sephora like they're really really big influential people and to be next to them like to be speaking with them is just a surreal moment and I texted my Ipsy friend and um or a partner of Ipsy and I was just like I don't know if I should puke or hyperventilate this morning <laughs> I just was like the nerves got over me you guys this morning um so I'm gonna have some of this salad now it looks so good it's got fresh tomatoes and I don't know what else is in this pineapple mmm wow look at the egg really soft tomato avocado in there and the bun I really like this bun is it brioche I think it's brioche or something um there's mandarin oranges in this wow it's so good everything's so fresh so if you're in Calgary it's called the ladybug cafe that's where I go to all the time 
By the way, thanks Calgary for taking off my tinted windows. It would be really nice to have those right now. <laughs> when we moved from Ontario, I had to get them off because you can't have them in Calgary or Alberta. Oh my God, how the heck am I gonna eat this? I'm so scared to get it on my sweater. Mm. Oh, should have asked for more napkins. Anyways, so I'm extremely nervous about this call. And I've met Christine Dominique actually before. She came to my Ipsy booth in San Fran when I had it years ago. And she's just always someone I've looked up to. I'm sure you guys know who she is. She has, I think, like 4.5 million subscribers on YouTube. And she's very influential. But even though, like, I'm nervous, I still think this is going to be such a learning experience even for me. And like I said, you can always learn from other people that are in your same field and do what you do every day. And it's nice to really get to know those people on a deeper level. So I'm. that's why I told you, like, audiobooks, honestly, are just the best thing ever in hearing other people influential you know entrepreneur people um in all different you know aspects like you can listen to like real estate or you know other forms and ways of uh making money not just like your business and i think that's kind of something that i'm looking into this year like you know not only do i have my company but other forms of revenue and that's kind of what you can get into once you become an entrepreneur and you're working for yourself like you know so I'm always listening to audiobooks. So let me know if there's any that you really enjoy that I can listen to. The other thing I really like is crime. Crime, crime, crime. I have been watching so many YouTubers lately, you guys. Like, and I've already told you this, like I'm obsessed with watching just like true documentaries and like crime shows and stuff like that. I just think they're so entertaining. And I mean, there are audiobooks you can also listen to. I was watching Kendall actually and she um, worked with Audible and she was recommending a ton of cr different crime. Um, there's one on, oh, what's her name? Let me just show you quickly because I know a lot of you guys are into crime as well because when I mention that, everyone's like, oh my god, I watch true crime. Let me see here. I, I just watched the video the other day. Okay, so it's JC Lee Dugard, A Stolen Life. So she has an audiobook and she was also recommending to listen to that. I, I That's what I have planned next because um, she was like held captive, I think for like 20 something years and then escaped. So I just find stories like that, and especially where there's good out of it. Like she escaped and, um, you know, now she's living her life and she has kids and, um, she's been, you know, doing these audiobooks and stuff. So I just think it's really cool to listen to st like real, um, true crime. But obviously when there's, it's a little bit better when people are found than, you know, yeah, when they're still missing. So, I mean, she has all sorts of ones that I've been watching, but I mean, it's just so entertaining. And I think, I don't know, I've always been into true crime and I grew up watching like Law & Order, Criminal Minds and all that stuff, like I told you guys already. Yeah, so I'm really nervous about that. Plus I'm launching my makeup line and getting everything ready for that. And I'm planning just to have a really chill mother's day honestly i want to do nothing i want to lay in bed relax have breakfast with the girls and maybe if it's nice out go outside play soccer with the girls and get ready for my launch party so i'll do a video and you guys will see like a behind the scenes and stuff that'll be really fun to do oh my god like look at this thing can you guys look it's like falling out <laughs> Ryan's going to kill me when he watches this because <laughs> he always says how messy my car is. <laughs> it's okay. I'll clean it though. He does like to clean it though because obviously he loves cars, but he's like, how is your car such a mess? And I, I think the last time he was in here, I have like 30 face masks on the floor. I had like 10 water bottles. It's just like, I don't know. I, I have a hard time keeping my car clean. Let me tell you. And now I'm eating eggs in my car. My friends all know and so does Ryan. <laughs> The other day we had our friends Kat and Joe come over. Hugo, their son, is like a year older than the girls. And it was really funny because like he or they brought so much steak over and I'm like, oh my god, that's so much steak. He's like, Well, I know you have to eat stuff. Like, I know how much you eat. And it's so true. Like, I eat as much as the guys and I'm so tiny, which is hilarious. But um I've always had a big appetite and probably now because I'm moving constantly and I'm like honestly all day long like that's my exercise like for the day is just like with the girls all day long moving so i just get so hungry especially in the mornings don't skip breakfast that was honestly one of my biggest like regrets is when you skip breakfast you need that energy like in the morning i always 
eat breakfast today a little bit later because I usually when I wake up at seven or eight like I'll eat right away but for the sake of filming this but let me know are there any like mukbangs that you guys watch this isn't really an ASMR so I apologize about that because I know a lot of you guys wanted to see that but I enjoy talking whoa those are some dark clouds I wonder if it's gonna rain the guy sitting in front of me is like I've been on his phone the whole time I wonder what he's doing I don't usually sit in my car like this. Oh my god. Oh god, where's that napkin? Mm. <laughs> and their iced coffees are so good. And that's one thing I like about the summer is like you can do iced coffees. Okay, so I might as well talk to you guys about my little launch party. I have a picture here for inspo, but I'm going to be doing like, it's not going to be that many people and it's going to be basically my close little circle friends, but it's basically going to be like a brunch. So it's from two to four and I just wanted to make it really like themed for the makeup launch. So you guys can see that there. That's what it looks like. I've never done like a boho theme ever. Uh, so my friend Kat was, cause she's very into that, um, What's it called? That look. And I mean, I love boho. It's just, it's never been my style. Oh my God, I saw these, by the way. And I was like, ooh, those would be so nice to make um, for the party. Oh, here's another picture of kind of like, that's what it looks like. That's the theme I'm going for. So like placemats and stuff will be like all of those, like not wooden. What am I thinking? Like the hay look. What's that called? Anyways, I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about, but I just need to go on the hunt for some bohemian style things. So, yeah, anyways, this is really fun to do. Ah! Okay, there goes my napkin. Yeah, but I hope you guys are doing well and keeping busy. I've noticed a lot with YouTube. Like, I don't know, maybe because I'm uploading not on consistent days, but my views have really gone down for some reason. I don't know why. But I've noticed that with everyone's channel. I don't know what happened but really love all the support and the comments when you guys leave comments it just makes me feel so good and it takes me a long time to like do these videos so I appreciate it I don't even know where to hold this thing mm. this is unreal this is so good mm. Next time, ask for more than one napkin stuff. And I have it on my pants already. It's okay. I'm, that's a good thing. I'm not trying to impress anyone any, any of these days. Like, I don't really care. <laughs> mm. Okay. I'm going to finish eating. This is my mukbang ending here. But I'm going to drive to HomeSense, see what I can find for decor, and see, like, what's out. So I'm going to take you guys with me. Oh, actually, first coffee. You guys are gonna laugh, but look what I just found in my bag. After all my complaining. Can you see what that is? Baby wipes. Okay, we are back, and me and Sophia wanted to help open up all the goodies. Are you helping Mama Mia? Sophia? <laughs> okay, so I got basically everything that you saw I got, you guys. So these glasses, I got like, these little flowers, which were so cute, 10 bucks. These are really pretty. Do you like that? Be careful. Wow. And then these I thought would be nice to put makeup into uh, for the party and then just like my brushes and stuff like that. Okay, so I'm just taking out everything right now. The girls are being so silly. Um, and then over here, it is very hard to find one this big though. So I just thought this would be so nice. And then also after um, we could put this outside on our patio table right there if you can see that but i think this is just such a nice big statement piece and the other stuff here just little things so what is that we have a candle right here some wooden plates right here trays i went with these ones these nice kitchen towels and what's in here and i ended up getting this bowl which this is going to be really nice Got more cups, more glasses. This basket's also really, really nice. I'm gonna fill it with like my uh, new makeup collection bundles. And yes, boo. Oh, here. So that is everything. I am just on my computer right now because I'm gonna 
get this video to my editor right after so I wanted to quickly show you what I got myself for Mother's Day and I've been wanting something small. I'll explain it in a minute. Boo boo, don't worry, daddy's gonna let you go outside in one second. He has to get the soccer ball, okay? Uh, let's go upstairs quick. <laughs> okay, I'm so happy though, you guys can see the vibes of the, of the launch party. It's very boho and I'm loving it. Yep, I just dropped this. Just wanna be honest with you guys. Not every morning is happy butterflies, that is for sure, so. That's unfortunate. closet we're gonna end it here but I wanted to quickly show you guys I already opened it yesterday because I was so excited a little gift for myself now to explain this uh, basically what I've realized is that I need something very small to go along with my diaper bag when we go out I've been used to having like a bigger purse and it just doesn't make any sense but it, it was hard to find one that was crossbody because I love crossbody if I'm with the girls I can't really hold a purse and especially if I have my backpack too so I got this I'm so excited to share it. So if you get something from fat, it's from Fashion Files, so that's what it looks like when it comes in. And it has, just thought I'd show you, this was brand new as well, so it wasn't used, it said brand new, or like brand new. And then, so it has all of like the bows and the ribbon and everything like that, the card in there. <laughs> I'm so excited about this, you guys, because it's the perfect size. It's a little mini bag. And I've actually wanted something from this collection for a long time now. So here is it up close. So beautiful. And on the inside here, it's actually red, which is really neat. I really like that. And it has the authentic card in there as well. And then the chain is like silver and gold, which is really neat. So it's like multicolored. I'm going to put it on. Here it is just to show you guys here. So it comes down to there on me, which is so perfect. And this is just like the perfect little bag to have. Okay, so my camera just died. I had to charge it for a minute. But what I was saying is this is just going to be the perfect bag for me for the summertime. And I can just obviously, if I'm getting something quick, even getting groceries, I think this is great because all I have is my phone and a card. Uh, so yeah, this is mini and it's perfect and it's just so cute. And I didn't think I was going to get black, but black is really growing on me. So I do really like it. And yeah, a little unboxing. And out of like all the pre-love stores that I have shopped at, I really do like Fashion File. They came so fast, especially for being in Canada, like really, really quick, just within a few days. Um, so yeah, that's what it looks like there. Really, really beautiful. So yeah, I am gonna end the vlog here because we are about to go outside, play soccer with the girls, and we're getting them ready for their soccer that starts next weekend. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited for the little get together I'm having for my party launch and I'll share more with you this week uh, of like sneak peeks and when I get the launch date ready for my new makeup line so I'm really excited about that but yeah it was fun to do a little bit of a different vlog today I did kind of like a mukbang shop with or shop with me video that I haven't really done before so I don't know let me know if you want to see more videos like that I guess it was just fun to chit chat with you have a coffee in the morning and work earlier I guess in the day uh, but yeah if you guys also have not yet joined Audible, make sure to go down to my description. And uh, yeah, I honestly, it's been amazing since I've been reading audiobooks and I find it to be extremely relaxing, especially at nighttime or throughout the day. If I'm cooking, like I said, I have so many errands and just the multitasking is real these days. Uh, so yeah, that has just been awesome. And uh, Rachel Hollis, also, if you haven't checked her out, I really highly recommend her audiobook because I'm obsessed. So I'll also have that down below for you guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any video recommendations for the summer, let me know in the comments. And of course, I will see you guys in my next video.